don't like, Vada Fly gonna recap this and say Gotti caught a 30 on the John Road. So all y'all wanna know what happened, I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. That was crazy, y'all the game. Time has Peter, nobody that knows body. Hit his area with 51. Everything in the fire fly. We used to rapping like that. Oh, nice. Nice. You pay for a titties, I pay for the telly. We are not the same, remember that. My shooter got aim, it's out of this world. I'm talking some shit off a minute block. Yeah, yeah, you already know what it is, man. Salute to the subscribers that notification gang, RiceGangClothing.com for the merchandise. You heard me right. Let the heaters blow. I ain't talking fast. You're listening slow. Um, salute to my guy Showtime SP also. B Dot versus Shotgun Shug. Whew, yeah, this was an interesting battle. One that a lot of people was thinking was going to be Battle of the Night and had picked to be one of the, like, this should have been the main event and all this and all of that. But I'm be honest with you, these guys got it in, man. Um, I like what Shotgun Shug did in this battle. Let's just start there. A lot of people was giving him no chance, was saying, y'all know what's going to happen. He's going to get smoked, etc., etc. But, dog, he has some kind of fire lines in this. Now, B-Dot was B-Dot. You know, B-Dot's coming off the Chiller Jones battle where he did not win. But uh, in this joint right here, he was dancing. I definitely got some notes and some quotes. You know what I'm saying? I ain't write down the whole battle, but I got enough that we can rabble. So... B Dot comes out in his first, and he has a fire line about you think you a vet till I go, lighten up, like lighten up the vitiligo. You think you a vet till I go? I thought that was fire. Uh, you can't expect a nigga that sell five dollar tees to see the profit. Selling five dollar tees to see the profit. I like that line. Uh, he had a aura better than what your physical form is. B Dot was rapping. Dearly departed, your aura is what you're better than what your physical form is. Uh, he had to be responsible. He said, your mama told you be responsible. Then she came back unresponsive. Uh, he said, my schemes be too drawn out until it's too drawn out. B-Dot is rapping, rapping in his first round. I'm not going to hold you. Uh, he had a cryptocurrency line that was fire. Shug comes out his first round. Demon time. I put the nine on the dot. Uh, he had a higher learning. This ain't Ice Cube. And he starts talking about B-Dot dissing his baby moms. And Shug is like in his bag in his first round. I had B-Dot slightly edging the first round. That's how I had it. You did. Um, second round, uh, B-Dot comes out. Uh, he had a line about Sharif, you fit the description better than I do, and then talked about a Pyru, and then it says U R I P, because when you flip Pyru, there's a U, then an R I P. I liked his energy. Um, he said, let me let me let home slide with this. And then he was talking about somebody being from Jersey. Now real sick is talking about, you know, now there's a real sick from Jersey. Uh, he had a uh, you you ain't did shit for the grapes, but cloud chase and then he talked about his logo bare face mask on it We will see his bare face, but then he put the mask on it uh, shotgun show comes out in his second round I'll take five and put it on God like I'm serious nigga my stock going up by the grace of God then he had smack off of the bread then he had a uh, They call me sure cuz I've been smacking niggas big man been getting biz smack Biombo nigga smack Bismack, Bismack, Biombo. That is the motherfucking uh, center for Charlotte Hornets. Bismack, Biombo. I like that line too. Uh, I had a one one going into the third. I'm not gonna hold you, man. I like the, the energy and shit that Shotgun Sugar was able to come with in his uh, in his second round. Uh, B dot third round. Uh, he had a little, little, little like what? Just like a one of them. I'm not really taking much from him because uh, he got through some fire material in his third round. Uh, you can't walk to his set crib shit, your stomach tatted, trying to beat thug life. That's your core problem. That's your core problem. Stomach tat rip. That's your core problem. I thought that that was fire. Uh, then he was talking about him getting robbed in the Jordan Down Project, saying point shaving, your own team robs you, because you know, you point shaving, your own team robs you, that was fire. Uh, talked about he threw his jewelry on the roof, his shit was so fake, they threw it on the roof. Now it's like me, your jewels on the roof, dropping jewels on the roof, shining. Oh, what the fuck, man, see that? <laughs> your jewels on the roof, shining, that shit was crazy. Uh, 
the Grandees, he was talking about him and Gucci Gotti battle, the Grandees, the Mafia ties, then um, Suge's third round, he comes out, you're not a punter, you're a runner, what's your life like? You thought you was checking me, your ex was going to be a factor, then he's talked about him being a bedpan African. Uh, Shotgun Suge has some heat in his third round. I ain't going to hold you, he definitely has some heat in his third round. This battle is wow close. Debatable to me in some regards, but if I have to pick one, I'm going with B-Dot because he was rapping, rapping. I'm picking B-Dot 2-1. I give B-Dot the first round. I give B-Dot the third round. Uh, you know, some people may see it another way, but you know, that's my first watch, first kind of view, view on the joint, and I liked what I saw. You know what I'm saying? So we're going to definitely talk some more. You already know what it's doing, what it does, so you got to ask what it was. Okay. What's good, y'all? I uh, let me, let me, let me think, let me, let me, let me get my mind right. Let me get my mind right. I gotta get my hold on. Let me, let me, let me get my mind right. I gotta, I gotta see what's happening here. Shotgun Shook versus B Dot. Clearly the best battle so far. That's already won. Um, gotta apologize for that, saying that I was gonna flick that one. No, no, this one is, this one, this one, this one might be fire. I mean, I might be tripping, let me know, because I'm still in the same side. I'm still in here. I'm still in here. So y'all can't, y'all can't already fault me if I say what I say, but I'm gonna say what I say. And y'all can't get mad at me for what I said, but what I said is what I said. So this is why I'm saying what I'm saying. Do y'all see what I'm saying? Check out my YouTube channel. That's the Showtime SP. I actually do do other stuff. Um, B Dot versus Shotgun Shook was, was really good on one end. Uh, on, 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 on one end, you kind of expected it to be one sided. Now, if you're a real fan, or if you're a fan of the rap, of the rap rap, of the rapidity rap rap, you're going to clearly say B-Dot won this battle 3-0 because he out-rapped Suge. You, if you're going to be a, 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 a person who's going to go against the grain, you're going to say Shotgun Suge 2-1. First and the third, I want to say, you you going to say that. you you That's what you going to say. But that's, let's be real. At the very least, at the very least, the bare minimum, I'm going to say B-Dot 2-1, man. I, man, Shug, you was rapping, bro. Shug. Shug. When you, when you start, Rap Father, you got to ask that question. Ask that nigga that question first. Hold on, because while you do that, I'm going to go ahead and score. First of all, Shug, this is what you look like normally to other people. You need to get your mitts. You, I'm Shug, yeah, the nigga Shug, the big nigga. The, well, he not really the big nigga because he the slim now. That's Slim Gun Shug now. Is that Shotgun Slim? Slim Gun Shug? I don't, I don't, I, I don't know. But needless to say, Shug, you was barring. You was rapping. Bad Pan African? I, I was, I was listening. I mean, listen, I'm not going to lie to y'all. So if you want to talk about who going to win the war, who might have won the war, Shotgun should really impress niggas. But B-Dot won the battle. B-Dot clearly won the battle. Like, B-Dot outwrapped Shotgun Suge. And that is something that we need to pay attention to is that B-Dot did win. He was supposed to win, and he did win. But niggas could debate this battle. This is one of those battles where I'm going to watch this again because I need to, you know, I got to get the ocular proof. But I already know when I get the ocular proof, the bars is going to definitely outmatch the other. But... In this battle, Suge was doing his thing. Suge was maybe stumbling, maybe, but I thought he was going to cut that round. Suge, nah, nigga, she said, how long you going? I'm going to go that distance with you, too. You, how, how, what, what, what time we rocking? I'm going to do that, too. Suge wasn't playing. This Suge is spooky, Suge. This B-Dot was B-Dot. He still beat Suge. I'm just saying that... I'm. Am I tripping? Just let me know. Because, I mean, once again, y'all can't fault me because I'm still in here. I'm just saying. But let me know in the comment section if, if y'all thought Suge really, he could have won this battle. But I, I, I still got beat out winning the battle. Still got 
Still got beat out winning the battle. But, shook. I need you to do that again. I don't, I don't believe that. I don't believe that one. I need you to do that one again. <laughs> call out the next name that you said you was going to call out. Because I, I, I kind of need that again. I just, I, you know, I, I need another hit of that shit. That... You got the juice, then give me that. So official with the flash. Got a move to kill a game. I might just hit you with it last. Off squad, take a shot, and then I hit you with the pass. Never thought I'd be this good. I feel like Mitchell with the jazz. Straight up. I crossed dude last week, and I got him falling still. A tag team like standing near or ball and bill. It's all the skill. A shot, I shoot it, drop in. We turn it up to 11 just for the top 10. SC at night, who dunking for real? I seen Dennis Smith jump and almost jumped in the wheel and left the gym. I keep coming with them worldwide heaters. Go by Jag the All-Star and we the worldwide leaders. Straight